The first hairstyle is going to be inspired by Asuna from Sword Art Online. This one is pretty easy. So basically, we're going to have two sections on the front, two pieces. Add leave-in, detangle, and braid that hair. So just make a long braid, like so, very simple, and secure it with a nice small hair tie. And basically, that's the main thing about this hairstyle is making these two braids and just repeat those steps to the side leave in detangle the hair braid it secure it and after we have our two braids tie them together with another hair tie on the back and basically that's the whole hairstyle it's pretty easy and it works very nicely with curly hair and yeah, looks nice. Let me know your thoughts. Do you like this one? Next on the list, we have Hachi with this hairstyle that is so cute. So I just started with a lot of leave-in in my hair. Just trying to make my hair more manageable. And after that, I'm going to part my hair. So I'm just trying to part it and make it look like hatchies as best as I can and after that you just have to section your hair so we have like the parts of the front that we're gonna work with and also the back so just section your hair like so so we can have different areas that we have to work with After that, more leave-in because I need that moisture and just brushing those sections on the front. Trying to make my hair as sleek as possible and the most important ingredient, a lot, a lot of gel. Because without gel, there's no way that I can tame my hair. So I'm just doing that, working into that hair, working that gel and brushing my hair after we make sure that the sections on the front are nice and slick we are gonna tie them together with a hair tie now that part is done it's time to focus on the second part of this hairstyle that it's the bun so first we're gonna do like a kind of a ponytail so, you know, just the way you do a ponytail, we're gonna go through one time, all the way through the hair tie, like so. And then the next time is gonna be halfway through it. Not all the way, so that way we get like a messy bun effect, like this one. And yeah, it kind of look like hatchies. A little bit but what makes this hairstyle is definitely the accessories so now that's all this is the hairstyle it looks super cute so now we have usagi from sailor moon the mother of all magical girls in existence yes so for this hairstyle we just have to section our hair into two parts like so we're gonna frame our hair just taking some parts of it on the front and we're gonna have another section up here so it's just like a high ponytail so with that ponytail we're gonna do a cute little bun so it kind of resembles the buns that makes this hairstyle To make the hair buns, I'm just going to twist my hair and do the bun like this because that way it has more of a shape and it's a little bit more structure. At least that's my thinking behind it. And I'm just going to repeat it. Grab this hair, tie it with a hair tie and just twist it. 
until I make a bun similar to the first one. Basically, this is just like space buns and leaving the rest of your hair all out. So that's another way to see it. So we're just gonna do those two buns and that's basically all to this hairstyle. It's super cute and it really made me feel like a Sailor Moon scout. Super cute. So the next one, it's the second part of this one, Inspire by Chibiusa, Sailor Moon's daughter. And this one is super easy because we have the buns already. So all we have to do is with the remaining hair, we're gonna twist it a couple of times like so. And we're gonna attach this behind our bun and secure it with some bobby pins. This is so cute. I find this, this one way more cuter. I don't know why, but at least to me, let me know. Do you like more the Sailor Moon Usagi hairstyle or this one? Let me know in the comments. So basically, just gonna repeat the same thing to the next side. And that will be all to this hairstyle. Super cute, it's very easy. And I'm glad that it worked with my very messy curly hair. And yeah, this one was very fun.